A boundary is one or more perimeters around a field. One field can have multiple boundaries and the area within each boundary can be accumulated to provide a total field area. Boundaries can be used to prevent application being applied outside when used with automatic section control. If this is the first boundary created, you can define the reference point to record from. This will either be the left or the right of the implement or the center line. Select the recording point and press OK. The recording point can be changed at any time by pressing this button. Press the record button and begin to drive mapping the boundary. The boundary will be mapped following the path driven unless the pause button is used. When paused, recording of the vehicle's path will not be logged and a straight line will be snapped back from where it was paused to the current vehicle's position. This will cause a straight line segment to be created. To close the boundary, you can press the stop record button when close enough to the beginning or simply pass the beginning point and the boundary will automatically close. You can define the automatic close distance in the Precision IQ settings under Patterns. With boundaries recorded for your field, you have the ability to define whether or not you want that boundary to be active. An active boundary is represented by a red and white dotted line, whereas a deactivated boundary is represented by a grey or white dotted line. An active boundary will mean that the application control will use this boundary for automatic switching. To quickly activate or deactivate a boundary, press and hold the Guidance Cycle button until the Pattern Selector tray appears. Any boundary, whether it was recorded as a boundary or automatically created from a Headland Guidance Pattern will be displayed here. Simply select the boundary you wish the system to use for automatic section control.